of uh, we just came off of a off year election in your home state of Virginia where uh, Republicans failed to meet even their benchmarks. Republicans generally have seen a net loss of seats in the House and the Senate and in governorships all since Trump was elected. So what will it take for Republicans? What will it take for the RNC chairwoman, whose job is uh, to secure the electoral prospects of your party, to say that this is not worth it anymore? It would take courage. It would take valuing the American people over a, a grifter and a shyster like Donald Trump. Um, it would take actually caring about what happens to this country in the future instead of caring about polling and fundraising and crosstabs. And that's the issue. You know, Trump can't really win a whole lot at the local election level, but he can certainly help people lose. And he's counting on that. So you have a party that's really held hostage uh, by somebody who understands that his power is in, a, in the base. And uh, again, she has to do what she has to do in order to continue to be in power herself. So really, it's a simple fact that she cares more about a party with an R behind it than she does about the American people. And it's also the fact that she can't tell the truth. Um, she can't tell the truth how she feels or she's not going to be the actual party leader anymore. And that's really what it comes down to. It comes down to power, comes down to money, uh, comes down to influence. And that's more important to people like Ronna McDaniel than the American people. And, and some self-preservation in there as well. Uh, former congressman, you know 